Lazy KH Chapter One: The Introduction. Hi everyone, it's me, Carrie Huang, and welcome to 2024. As a brief self-introduction, there's two main aspects to my life journey I'd like you to know about my YouTube life, and my Stanford life. So for the YouTube side, I have a twin brother, Michael Huang. The two of us created an animated web series on YouTube called Battle for Dream Island starting in 2010, which is based off of the TV show Survivor. It features humanized objects like pens, pencils, and erasers as the characters. The characters are battling for the grand prize of Dream Island, and every episode, the viewers vote in the comments who they want to be eliminated. This show has developed a mini fandom of sorts online, with 2 million subscribers, about a billion views, and at least a thousand spin-off object shows created and animated by fans. We also now have an amazing team of 30 people helping us create episodes, from writers, to artists, to audio editors, to animators. As always, I'm extremely grateful for how many people have supported our YouTube journey over the years. I never thought it would get this big when I started in elementary school. Now onto the Stanford side of my life. I studied computer science from 2015 to 19. There's multiple tracks within the CS department at Stanford, including biocomputation, CS theory, visual computing, graphics, computer engineering, and artificial intelligence. I picked AI to specialize in, partly because I was inspired by Andre Carpathy's 2015 articles on neural networks, and partly because about 50% of my college friend group did the same thing and I wanted to stick with them. This was also before the huge AI boom with Midjourney and ChatGPT entering the mainstream in 2022. Anyway, during those four years in the heart of Silicon Valley, I think I saw a fair deal of how the tech industry works, even though I sort of quit everything tech-related once the pandemic started. On top of that, in the late 2010s, I made a few educational videos on my channel KH that show fun AI experiments, like creating AI-generated jazz, using autoencoders to make new celebrity faces, or using evolution simulation to teach creatures how to walk to the right. Still, I'm no expert when it comes to venture capital or Y Combinator or startup stuff like that. But I'd like to think that this mixture of my creative upbringing from my YouTube life with the academic STEM rigor of my Stanford life might provide an intermingled perspective that some of you viewers may find interesting to listen to, maybe? I want to get this video out on January 1st, 2024, since that's a cool looking date. Well, it's 11.47pm here in California, so I'm running out of time, so I'm going to cut off the video here and upload the rest later.